Hello again YouTubers, it's uh, Coleco Nut here again and uh, as a follow up to my long, and I apologize for that, video on my loose ColecoVision collection I just want to share with you my uh, Atari 2600 collection uh, loose, not boxed, I have a whole bunch of boxes full of boxes but uh, maybe this time rather than drone on for 10 minutes plus on individual titles. I'll just kind of scan and bring a few of the notables to your attention. Note that a couple might look like they're duplicates but there'll be some kind of label variation which uh, which I tend to collect. So I'm just going to scan through them and if there's something that jumps out I will bring it to your attention. A couple of Apple Vision. These are multi carts. These are two different ones. Multiple games. Apple Vision. Gosh, was that uh, South American? I don't recall. There's a few different titles here. And, uh, you know, with regard to uh, label variations, you know, it might be that uh, it's a text versus picture, or there's some other, something else about it that makes it. Uh, unique. Boeing is a tough one to get. <clears throat> My bad, I had a lovely pristine boxed Boeing. I was short on cash and I put it on eBay and I wish I had it back because I haven't seen one since on there. Beasties, not uh, an easy title. Let's see what this one is. Crips of Chaos. These types of labels, they're uh, generic Taiwan. Some of them came uh, from Sellers, uh, which was a, a store in, in, in Canada that uh, put their own logo on some of the generic Taiwan boxes. So they're now known as Zellers Games. Let's see. Demolition Kirby, no end label. What have we got here? Dark Cavern. Dactar, we've got a couple of Dactars. These are, I believe, Colombian multi carts. South American. Mm, Flash Gordon, a very poor label, but I don't have another copy of that. As yet, as food. Here's another <clears throat> multi cart uh, by Angus Hoft. Dragon Treasure. These are just Donkey Kong and Junior label varieties. Freeway. Football, etc., etc., etc. Let's see what else I have here. I've got a breakaway and a very poor version of Fishing Derby. I'll have to get me another one when I see one. On to the next box. Harem. This is a G-rated channel, so I won't go into detail about that one. These are, as far as I know, all... NTSC games. I don't think there's any PAL games, but one might have slipped slipped by me. Now well, a guy, I'm sure, I'm sure that's a repro. Lost luggage. A couple of label variations on that. What do we got here? Oh, King Kong. I have the end label, but I just haven't reaffixed it. A couple of multi, uh, sorry, um, double enders. This one's hard to find. And 
that is Nash. Pinball, another Zoners game, I believe. What we got here? Outlaw, a common. Oh, here's a unique one. You don't see this one too often. It's kind of a long cart, and it's cosmic swarm. See how it's longer than its other counterparts. And on to the S's, Seahawk Zellers game. A couple of Space Invaders. What have we got there? Stacker. Remember Stacker, I think every restaurant uh, pit stop on the highways here, you go in and there's a Stacker game. Waste a few quarters. I guess nowadays it's probably a buck. No name. Oh, Taz with no label. Tapper, there's a good one. Couple here, what have we got? Survival Run. Milton Bradley. Super guy. Winter games. Some label variations. A couple of adventure variations. Up and down. Another good one on any system. That's a good game. And finally. There we go. Thanks for joining. There's my Atari 2600 loose collection.